My name is John Choi. I'm an English teaching assistantship grantee at Ushak University. This year is my second year in Ushak. I give faculty classes to academic personnel and professors at the university. I also provide intensive English classes for Erasmus students at the university who are preparing to study abroad in Europe. This is my second year in Europe, second year here in Turkey. During my first year, I fell in love with the country. I never thought I was going to come to Turkey, but here I am for a second year. Canteen. What else? Board. Yes, board. What else? Chair. Chair, okay. 2007, correct. 27. <laughs> with white gowns, oh. with a hat, and they dance, and they spin. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Good. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's a Turkish name. In this sentence, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And long sentence. Uh, who is Ali? Ali is... Blah. Lor <laughs> and... Lion. Lion, what animal is Lion. Yeah. King. Yeah. Yes. Ali is the teacher. Yeah. Right now, we are at a cafe. We are drinking tea, some coffee. We're enjoying our time. This is one of my favorite cafes that I come to, to relax, spend time. I like to also play backgammon in Turkish tavla. I like to smoke nargile or hookah, water pipe. And this is what I do in my free time after a long day at the university. One thing I also love about Turkish culture, Turkish people is that they are so welcoming. They're so loving. They are very hospitable. Uh, one thing I love about Turkey is that Every region, every city, every part of Turkey is unique, distinctly unique, distinctly different with their food culture, even their accents. But um, one thing that is the same is the hospi hospitality. People are so willing to buy me food, take me places, invite me over to their house for food, uh, Turkish tea, Turkish coffee. I have truly fallen in love with this country and the people here. And that is why Turkey will always be in my heart and I want to continue to come back to Turkey, whether it's for an academic reason, a professional reason, or just for a personal reason, to visit my family and friends again. I love Turkey.
Uh, my name is Russell Wajardo. I teach at Balikasir University. Uh, this is my second year. I'm a renewal grantee. I'm teaching beginner preparatory uh, classes in speaking and listening, uh, as well as a listening course in the English language teachers uh, department. Uh, I decided to start taking Turkish in college, and then I really wanted to come to Turkey to actually get uh, to learn more about Turkish culture and society and also to improve my Turkish language skills as well as get teaching experience which as I said I did not teach at all before coming to uh, Turkey as an ETA and getting that experience has definitely uh, given me a lot of patience and uh, I've really enjoyed being introduced to all of the students. The students are wonderful and a lot of fun. Uh, well, I'm applying to a master's program at uh, Coach University in Istanbul in uh, international relations, so hopefully I will be up there for the next two years uh, as a student again. My name is Gregory Campbell. I work at Bolakese University and I teach um, beginning, intermediate, and advanced level classes. This is my second year in Turkey. I fell in love with the people, I fell in love with the country. If I can say in Turkish, uh, Turkey day, Omak Tan, Sevdim, Sevdim. Before I came to Turkey, I was afraid that I was going to get blown up. I hate to say that, oh. but <laughs> I thought it was a terrorist country. Really did. Everyone in America that I knew said it was like, it's so dangerous, but it really isn't. And now after being in Turkey, it's just uh, the country of mothers, I think they call it. And I, I feel that everywhere. I'm always welcome. The mothers are always taking care of me as well as the fathers and the children and everyone else. The people are just so warm. You, I just can't describe it in, in words adequately. Hopefully I'll be staying in Turkey and teaching at a university in Çanakkale. Alison Meyer, I teach at Anadolu University in Eskishkir, and I teach in the English prep school or the Hazerlik program. Before I came to Turkey, I honestly didn't know much about it at all. I studied the culture and studied the history and of course studied how to teach English a bit, but since I got here, I'm just struck by how kind and how open and caring everyone is and they want to support us as teachers and support us as foreigners or just as people here in Turkey and it's very nice to have that camaraderie with everyone that I meet. I would say that it has just been probably a life-changing experience <laughs> and for the better and um, how so? Well I've just learned to be more more kind to people because I've been welcomed with such great hospitality and I now feel the need to give it on to other people and be more open to people of, of different cultures and nationalities and willing to accept anything that comes my way. I'm Cassie. I'm a teacher at Anadolu University. I'm teaching pre-intermediate English in the preparatory school here. And for you? I'm Caitlin Cleary and I also teach at Anadolu University. I'm teaching upper intermediate classes in the Hazerlik Preparatory Program. We, we meet up with friends, go to the bar, go to bar street, um, go shopping at the mall. Yeah, it's pretty much like normal life. Seems like there's a pretty good nightlife here in Eskishir. There is a good nightlife here in Eskishir, so that's a lot of fun. We go out a lot of times with our colleagues, things like that. Some other things, um, I started taking guitar lessons from my friend Jean Cot, and that was interesting to learn some Spanish classical guitar in Turkey, and then also started salsa dancing. So 
guess I'm getting the Latin flavor in Turkey. Right. I was, I came here expecting to work hard and also make friends with colleagues and students. I was surprised at what a tremendous professional development experience it's been. I, we really, they really have high standards for us and we are expected to perform highly as well. And you, Caitlin? Uh, this has been a really wonderful experience. I had taught before, um, but teaching in this environment, now I know that I want to teach full time and interacting with the students had several great experiences and I know now that that's definitely what I want to do. Um, I can't stay away from Turkey. I'm planning on making the move to the big city, Istanbul, in the fall and continuing my teaching journey. Okay. And you, Caitlin? I will be going back to the States for at least a short time, but I'm hoping to get a job with a disaster relief organization that has recently started working in Turkey. Uh, so I hope to be working with them and also get my teaching certificate. We are playing game when we take our education. It's so beneficial for us because we are uh, entertaining and we are teaching at the same time. Your English is very good. Did you learn English before Caitlin teachers classes? No, actually, uh, when we start with Caitlin, uh, especially speaking, it's so beneficial for us, for everyone. We started to speak more relaxed. Wow, very good, mashallah. <laughs>